Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Josh with Wisconsin Fishing Adventures, and over the past couple of weeks, we have been on a phenomenal smallmouth bite. Been catching quite a few small fish, but quite a few 17, 18, even 19 inch smallmouth mixed in. So uh, we've primarily been throwing the Acme V-Rod. Um, over the next couple of videos, I'll show you guys kind of how to work that. And what we're doing is we're working the main lake points because they warm up a little bit quicker in the spring with the sun beating on the shore, kind of warms up that water a little bit quicker and focusing on the shorelines where the wind is blowing towards. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. In the next one, I got my dad out and we absolutely crushed him. So make sure if you guys haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so you don't miss any videos. Let's get right into it. Not sure what that is, but it absolutely smashed it on the fall. Thought I was gonna take the rod out of my hand. Big old smallie. Just chunky, not big, I guess. All wrapped up. As you guys will see, the smallmouth go pretty nuts for this V-Rod. Sometimes you'll even get multiple bites on a cast. It's very fun when it works. Chunky little girl. I cannot believe how hard it hit it. Boat took the rod out of my hand. Let her go. There we go. White bass? Nope, smallie. Just a widow guy. Another one. Every cast, guys. This one is not as big. Just as angry though. Oh, a dark one. I know it's not big, but look how dark that fish is. Got a big old scar on him too. Let him go. There's a good one. Feels good anyways. Oh yeah. Another really nice smallie there. Not huge, but nice and chunky. A lot of fun catching them this time of year. They get pretty angry. Kind of funny, guys. I was going to throw the jig in a plastic more today. I threw it for a while, 
had a couple of fish hit it, but they just didn't hit it good. Switched over to the V-Rod, caught three on it. Oh, I lost them. Notice how I pause here for a second and then I continue to work the bait back. Got another one. Holy smokes, they are fired up, guys. This one feels good. Feels really good. A lot of times when smallmouth are schooled up, another fish will chase the fish that you hooked. So if you lose it, you keep working the bait back and hope for another bite. Come on, baby. It's angry. Oh yeah, another nice one. And she is angry. Come on. There's another good one. Not huge fish, but definitely some nice ones. And they fight like heck this time of year. Oh man. Not big, but every cast with a few big ones mixed in. Makes for a fun evening. Ooh. Oh my goodness. That was another violent bite. Nothing better than pre-spawn angry smallies on the blade bait. Oh boy. Come here, big girl. Not as big as I thought, but man, they're fighting a lot bigger than they actually are today. Pretty fun. When these fish are biting it today, as soon as it starts falling, they are absolutely crushing it. It's an incredible bite and it's a lot of fun. Man, these fish fight so incredibly hard. Oh, that's not quite what we're after. These fish fight pretty hard too, contrary to what some people say. Not what we were after guys, but this lake also has a pretty healthy walleye population. Walleyes and smallmouth like to hang out quite a bit. We're gonna get that one back. If you look, something actually took a swipe at that guy right there. Pretty crazy. Let her go, season's not open. That's a good fish.
chunk. Uh, man. About 18 inches. Not bad at all. That one feels all right. I think we're gonna wrap it up after this fish today, guys. Had a good time, caught a bunch of fish. Some really nice ones, some little ones. Gonna bring my dad out for a couple hours tomorrow and see if we can get him on some of these nice smallies. Such a fun bite, so feisty. Like I said, guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. A lot of fun using that blade bait for smallies. This isn't the biggest one. Caught a lot bigger ones earlier, but even this size bass fight really hard. A lot of fun to catch, especially when they're smacking it on just about every cast. Stay safe and tight lines, guys.